Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we are going to see how to create dynamic URLs in Laravel. So dynamic URLs means the URL will be the constant, but it will be changing for each ID. So I'll just show you. So this is our routes.php, sorry, web.php under route folder. So here we will create one edit thing for the products. So in the last video, we had seen how to fetch the categories for the products. So we'll open it resource views and the product blade.php. Okay. So we'll see the output now, how the output is. Okay. So we want to add a edit button over here for all the products. So when we click edit in the next page, it should take this details and show it in a text box over there. So let's get started. So first we'll create a route over here. So type route get use get method and give edit let us give edit slash and we'll be passing a id over here for the product this will be inside this okay and here we will put it in the my controller we'll use my controller here my controller at edit function we'll use okay so we'll just copy the function name copy go to the controller and create a function over there with the name public function and just paste the name which we copied from there edit okay so now we are passing an id in this so we have to pass the id in the edit function dollar id here so here we will just fetch the data from the products table which data we want here with the id we have sent so we'll create a variable with the name product products call the model product model and here we'll use the find function to get the id so pass the dollar id in this now we will return view return a view so we will create a page with the name edit.blade.php and let us pass the variable in this compact within single quotes just put the variable name okay so now let us create a page with the name edit.blade.php so under resources views just new file did dot blade dot php hit enter so let us use the same this extends paste it here copy and paste it here okay so now we will take the same structure for now we'll just copy this table copy paste so we'll write here product edit so product id name keep it in a text box here put type equal to text and value just give this in that value over here okay So this will be the and then the name just paste it here price and the description here so here we are using a for each loop for in that table we are using for each loop because you had multiple data so here we will be having a single data because we are editing a single data so we don't require for each loop here we'll remove it and make the indentation proper so now this row is it will tell undefined so let us remove the row and put the variable name which you are passing it in the controller we are putting products here right so we'll copy products and here we'll just paste it dollar products of id and all the data so now let us check the output so it should work 
okay so but we have not we have not added the edit button in this main page so let us add one more field here with the this will be a, a tag here oops give a href and within double braces add url let us give edit slash concatenate the id of that row in this just copy this and outside this just give dot and concatenate along with that okay href let us add a class for this for the design class btn btn primary and let us name the button edit here we'll give the text as edit i will add the header also here edit so now we are ready to check the output so reload the page and now we have the edit so i am clicking on id number 2 edit here so now let us see what happens it's going to the edit slash id number 2 so now you have this all your data has been fetched here so let's go back and we'll edit for 4 here so we'll get id number 4 here so okay, id number 4 electronics category so how to update this data we'll be seeing in the further videos in this video that's it guys we have created a dynamic url and dynamic pages the same page we are using it for editing different products so thank you for watching this video guys please like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you for watching